Hey guys, I wanted to hop on really quick because I um, had a friend send me some knives. Um, he just kind of wanted to pay it forward to me. So um, I wanted to do a quick video. I put it off. I haven't had time to really do any videos. So I thought I better hop on and do some. But um, my friend Arizona Bladesman has a YouTube channel and I really had just barely subscribed to him for maybe a month and then he did this video where he surprisingly was going to send me some of his own collection knives, and he sure did. Um, the first one he sent me was this um, cookery. Um, it was out of his own collection. I'm not really sure where it came from. I know he said the cookery house, but it's not the cookery house in Nepal or, where um, Donnie B. Um, all day has his knives made and sold. But this is my very first cookery. It's got a very... Um, thick spine there but yeah this is my very first one and he said I might want to do something with the handle maybe um I don't know if I will or just leave it leave it like it is and I haven't had a chance to use it yet it's pretty sharp and um and then it came with this awesome sheath and then it has two little knives stuck down in here and I can't remember what he said that he that you do with those but um I think he said one of them you might use to sharpen the blade. Excuse my nails. I got to go get them done here in a few minutes. I hate going to get my nails done, but if I don't, I end up chewing them if I break them. And then with COVID going around and flu season, I do not need that. So otherwise, I wouldn't mess with it. Anyway, so there's that one. And I'm sure that was a little bit too much information, TMI. Then he gave me his boot knife out of his collection. It's my first boot knife. And not sure where he came where it came from or the name of it. But it's um pretty sharp. And yes, it does fit down on my work boots very well. So that's what he would tell me he was sending, and then he threw in a little extra, which is um really floored me because this thing's a beast but it's a I, it's a I looked it up it's a shrade and it's a um I think it's an SCH um I think 48 Jethro and it's high carbon steel and it really is a beast this thing is full tang it's heavy it's got like a rubber type handle which will be really good to hang on to um I can't wait to try this out. It's really, I think it's like 18 inches long. Like I said, a high carbon still. And I really, really do appreciate that. Um, Arizona Bladesman. I think he's under 100 subscribers. Um, he's into martial arts and he collects weapons and he's into the Second Amendment. He's a really great guy. I mean, he had, you know, who who sends someone they barely know uh, knives out of their own collection? It, it means a lot to me, and I will treasure these forever. I'm, I, I probably won't pay these forward because just because it does mean a lot to me that you thought of me to, um, you know, to send them to me. So. Um, <clears throat> I really do appreciate it. So if you don't know who he is, it's Arizona Bladesman. I will put his the link to his channel in the description below. Um, and then also, uh, I have some other knives I ordered that I'll do some videos on later. But um, I've got this alfalfa thing going on. But uh, anyway, um, another thing I wanted to say real quick is I wanted to do a shout out for um, Colleen, uh, Winging It with Irish Colleen. Uh, she hadn't been on for a while, so I hadn't really checked her channel. So I guess about a month ago, she had posted a video about some things that were going on in her life. Um, she's an awesome, awesome lady. She's been through a lot. And um, so if you guys, I just wanted to say some prayers for her. And, and if you guys haven't seen that video that, you know, um, that you are subscribed to her, that you can go check it out and send some love and prayers for her and her dad and um uh I, I don't know how she's doing right now so um you know I, I emailed her and I don't think she's emailed me back so yet but uh anyway if you guys would think of think about her and
keep her in her prayers. And I also want to shout out for um, uh, Choir Boys Cutlery. Um, he's got a really good channel. He got a lot, has a lot of new subscribers, and he's going to get ready to do another giveaway. Um, he also lost his job a little while back, a week or a week or so ago. So we keep him in your thoughts and prayers. And um, and he's a really good guy, and he deserves the best. And he's got an awesome channel. And then um, um, Shredder Knives. Um, it's a father and son channel. Um, go check them out as well. Um, I love their videos, and they also do a Monday with Mama with you know, Mama. So, um, yeah, um, and also I want to throw in Pro Carry Trucker. He's almost a um, 500. I think he, I thought he was one away and now he's like two away, I think today. So, um, he does a lot of uh, um, gun videos and just a, a lot of vlogs and stuff. So, Pro Carry Trucker, Winging It with Irish Colleen, Arizona Bladesman, and um, Choir Boys Cutlery. Um, uh, fabrications, Bruce of Fabrications. I bought a little mini stove from him, which I'll try to do a video soon on that. Um, a really cool stove and really good guy. So if you guys could just check them out and go show them some love and, um, and yeah, so it's good seeing you guys and I'm going to go, uh, get some stuff done today and I will talk to you guys later. Take care. Much love. Bye.